Welcome to Inside PTI, weekly videos designed to get you the trial information you want, agronomy explanations you need, and insights that will help you uh, for success on your farm. Today I want to talk a little bit about nitrogen management. We do a lot of nitrogen trials here at the PTI farm and one of the things that's, that's really been a game changer for us is dual band nitrogen with Conceal. So how are we using Conceal? One of the best programs on this farm is what we call a triple split program. Actually shows up or showed up last year in 2019 as our number eight product in our top 10 of ROI items. And uh, a triple split program is basically this. We're applying nitrogen three times. The first time with our weed and feed it represents 25% of our total program. Then we come in the second time with the planter with dual band Conceal represents another 25%. And then we come in side dress, and that's going to be 50% of our total in. But this spoon feeding of nitrogen has allowed us to grow some of our highest yields when we're looking at some of these nitrogen programs. So what I want to do is take you out in the field where we've used this Conceal product, applying nitrogen, and I want to show you dual band nitrogen applications versus non planter treatments at all, weed and feed, and we'll show you what the corn looks like, plant health-wise, what the stalks look like, and ultimately what the ears look like as we try to kind of you know, assess what yield's going to be. So let's go to the field, and we'll start off by looking at some of our weed and feed applications, our one and done, and we'll see what that corn looks like. Okay, so I want you to take a look at some of the differences in the way this corn looks. This corn over here um, on my right is 100% weed and feed application. So surface applied, broadcast, um, no, no high concentrations, no banding at all. It's just weed and feed. And look at how we're dying and drying compared to the same one shot of nitrogen with Conceal. Look at the way the plant health changes. Look at how you know, alive this plant is. Um, you know, we're still sending sugars and energy to that ear, building test weight. Here, we're done for the season. And so we're not giving ourselves a chance with the one and dones to finish. Here with the high concentrated uh, band of nitrogen, we're doing a good job of continuing to feed this plant. Again, these are one, um, one applications of nitrogen. We don't recommend that. We like to spoon feed. So let's go look at some of the spoon feeding that we've got with the triple split program that I mentioned earlier. Number eight in our top ROI products, 25% of nitrogen with a weed and feed, 25% on the planter with conceal, and then 50% as a side dress. Let's go look at it. All right, this is our triple split program. This is a program that's done so well at the PTI farm here over the last three years. And this could be our fourth year in a row, by the way, some of this corn looks. But again, 25% of our nitrogen, you know, spoon feeding along going on with weed and feed, another 25% with our planter with conceal. And then the last spoon feeding comes from side dress. But again, giving ourselves a chance to finish spoon feeding this corn, this has been a, a rock star nitrogen program for us. now. We're gonna go ahead and pull some ears out. We'll put them on some display boards and we'll just take a look at some of the one and done programs compared to this. And then I'll show you some of the dollar values we've seen over the past few years. All right, we brought some plant samples out here so you guys can take a look. There's a drastic difference between these, these plant samples. Again, here's our weed and feed, our one and done. We don't really recommend this situation, um, really in any situation, but you can see how this corn kind of ran out of gas. Over here, you, we've got a greener plant. The plant health is, is, is exceptional. But, but we've had you know, more access to nitrogen, keeping this thing alive, keeping it, keeping it going, trying to put test weight into this ear. So one of the things I like to do when we evaluate the plant health is, you know, and we, we'll do some stalk nitrate testing. Um, we gotta let this corn get black layered yet. Uh, some of this is not yet. I gotta get it black layered, and then we'll go out and do some, some stalk nitrate testing, and we'll find out how much did, you know, nitrogen did we need to finish? I mean, how much did we run out of gas? And so, you know, here is the, the, you know, this is the type of stalk that we take from this type of plant here. This is basically six inches off the ground, then we take an eight inch sample, but there's a big difference between stalk diameter in these two nitrogen applications. Now, one thing too, we, want, like, we like to split, split stalks. And what I've done with this plant, and again, is, is <laughs> we've basically died here and I'll pull the ear back so you can kind of take a look at it. Not a terrible looking ear, but look what we've got left. So this is our factory here. And one of the things that we always look for is cotton pithing. And so I've taken my knife and kind of split this stalk in half and you can see 
this looks like a bunch of cotton in here. We've got tissue here that, that basically, that, I mean, this plant's cannibalized itself, trying to get nutrients. And, and that's why it's, it's in this shape right now. It just ran out of gas. Now, if we take where we've got dual band conceal and we split some of these stalks open, I'll show you how we do this. I'm just gonna pull some of these leaves off of here. I'm just gonna split the stalk in half and then look at each and every node but we've got a much wider, we've got a cleaner stalk. There's more, more uh, uh, liquid, if you will, uh, more sap inside here. And so this thing is still moving nutrients up and down this plant, still alive. That's why it's green. And the plant health is just exceptional on this. And if we go ahead and pull the ear back, you know, we'll have to see, I mean, it feels like a heavier ear between these two plants but we'll just have to see where yield comes in at at the end of the day. But, but th this plant basically died, it gave up on us, and we just didn't give it a chance to finish. Where we've got the right nitrogen program, we're still cranking here, adding weight to this ear. Now, what kind of yield difference do we have? Let's go pull some ears off, and we'll actually evaluate the difference between dual band nitrogen and the weed and feed, one and done. All right, so what are we finding maybe yield estimate wise? Well. We got a big difference in our ear weights. We're way out here weighing our ears to try to estimate yield. And you know, we're running about a half a pound on our, on our just our one shot and done weed and feed. But then we move up to a split application of 50% weed and feed, 50% side dress. We move up 23% on our ear weight. Now we're up to about 0.64 pounds per ear. But here's the thing guys, the triple split program we talked about has been you know, our big winner in the past. You know, we're running up to about 0.75 pounds, and that's an additional 17% um, increase in ear weight. And that's the thing we're looking at. Can the, the triple split program, the spoon feeding the nitrogen, weed and feed early, followed by the planter with conceal, and then a side dress, could that be given a 17% increases in ear weight? That's what we need to find out with the combine, but it looks pretty promising right now. So today's Inside PTI agronomy tip of the day is placement of nitrogen has been crucial for us at, here at the PTI farm. You know, you look at the past three years of our research, we're showing advantages of $60 an acre for this triple split nitrogen program that, that we've talked about here today. Again, 25% with a weed and feed, 25% with our dual band conceal, and then the other half with, with a side dress. That's given us $60 additional um, income. And guys, here's the thing, our nitrogen cost is not changing. We're using the same amount of nitrogen on a per acre basis, so our cost is the same, but we're driving, we're bringing home, driving yields up, bringing home another $60 worth of income. So placement of nitrogen is key. If you have any questions about anything we've talked about today, feel free to reach out to any Precision Planning Premier dealer, or check us out on our website at precisionplanning.com. That's all the time we have for today. We'll see you on the next episode of Inside PTI.